I am shocked and saddened and like you, angry about how protests have been inflamed by these less lethal munitions earlier this week in Brooklyn Center. Um, and I don't know that the public knows that this is something that has been explored uh, by our mayor and our chief. We've imposed a number of new policies on our own law enforcement um, and trained on it since last summer. But at this point, um, this doesn't feel like the right way to go. We do not, as the attorney just mentioned, have this authority. Um, so I won't be able to support this because this feels more um, like a, a, a not a statement of values. I share these values, but this seems like a statement um, that we shouldn't make until we rely on the experts. Our expert here is the chief. Um, I think it would be dangerous to change course and it would be really nice if we could spend our time working together on these kinds of things because I think there's opportunity to. But yes, I deplore the use of rubber bullets. My values here are right, right in line with yours. Make no mistake on that. I think that we're escalating tensions in Brooklyn Center when our aid partners are using less lethal munitions and we must look to do things differently. But what we're doing now, this use of force continuum, our policy clamps down pretty hard on it with the exception of our chief himself authorizing it. It really clearly states that. Um, I don't think that this can give the public the salve um, uh, that they need right now if it's meaningless, even though voting against this feels bad right now. Um, I don't think we know all the ramifications of doing something like this yet. We don't know the implications of passing an absolute ban on all less lethal munitions.